Our video tutorial is about how to generate student report card using Microsoft Excel program. The first step is to fill up this data sheet asking for grade and section, class advisor, down to curriculum. The next sheet is for the LRN names, age, gender, and the grades from first grading up to fourth grading in every subject. The next sheet, you will see here a name and all the grades from first grading up to fourth grading for each of the subject. Next sheet, we will determine the rank or you can arrange the student in separate male and female from highest to lowest so that you can determine the rank. Next, another sheet, you can see the average grade per grading period in every student so that you can determine the top 10 for the owners. Now let us go back in this sheet for the subject grades. Fill this column LRN names and all the subject in every grading period. Supposing we have here the LRN, the name and this data and you have done entering and you have entered the grades in the first grading period. You will see in a separate sheet where the template for the card with its column with the column for the first grading grade is filled up then continue entering the grades in the second grading as soon as you have collected the grades you can see the second grading column filled up in its corresponding subject in its student next as soon as you are done entering the grades in the third grading period of each student and another template, a card with its third grading column grades is filled up. Next, until you are done up to the fourth grading period, you can see in a separate template the a card with the column for the fourth grading grade, the final grade, and the remarks up to its general average is filled up. Then fill this column for the months, the number of school days, and the number of days the student is present. Then you will see in a separate sheet. You will see at the same time with the port grading period grades, the number of or the report on attendance of each student. Just fill this up, these empty spaces for the number of times the student is tardy. Now suppose we are going to print the card of the next student because we have several students in our list. Simply go to the card template click this LRN number and then automatically a drop down menu will appear click this drop down menu we notice that the highlighted number is the same as the number inside the box which corresponds to this name by clicking the LRN number just below the highlighted number Automatically, the name will be changed, the age, and all other data like the grades and attendance will change automatically by clicking the drop this drop down menu. So follow the same procedure as you print the cards of the next student in our list. So that's enough. So we print the uh, student report card using this uh, blank below paper. So we will insert this uh, sheet of vellum paper into the printer and we command the first reading sheet to be printed. So file, print, page 1, then print.
so this is now the printed front page of the card now we will insert this again so that the back page will be printed we will command the second page to be printed so page 2 print This is now the printed back page of the card. Then we will insert this card again. Supposing we are done with inputting the second grading grade. So insert the card. Then we will command the second grading sheet to be printed. So file, print, first page. Print. Now the printed second grading grade, we will insert this again for the printing of the third grading grade. Supposing you are done with importing the grades to the third grading. So file, print, enter. done with printing the third grading grades then we will insert this again for the printing of the fourth grading grade so we will choose the fourth grading sheet to be printed so file print enter This is now the fully printed card up to port reading. So back to back, this is our printed card using the Microsoft Excel. Then subscribe. That's enough.